let's take a look on the insides. I, I always like a dog picture, and I've got a, a couple of dog stories. I think you've got dog story too. I just love this picture. This is the Duchess of Cornwall, um, and this is Flora. And they met at a reception for the 160th anniversary of the Battersea Dogs and Cats Home, um, which is obviously a welfare charity, of course. Um, I just think it's a nice picture. Also, Duchess of Cornwall um, turning 75 on Sunday, so happy birthday. 160 years. Yeah, Battersea Cats and Dogs Home yeah. is in. Yeah. Actually, yeah, wow. it's a marvelous thing. And I uh, just a quick tip because we were talking about the heat, and obviously, as I said, Matt's gonna keep us updated. Did you know you can buy dog sunscreen? Because I have when I, when I had um, cats which had very fine hair on their ears, so I did put sun cream on my cat's ears when it was very hot one summer, and it, they didn't appreciate it, but I felt better. But apparently, there is dog sunscreen. And um, the advice is that if you go walking with your dog, if you're taking them along to the beach, cliff tops, etc. You don't feel the heat from the sun because obviously it's breezy, um, but there is sun. There is um, sunscreen, pet-safe sunscreen. Apply it before you go into sunshine. Fifteen minutes before. Um, SPF 30 on your dog. Reapply every 30 to 40 minutes. So look after your dogs you because they look after us. Of course, aren't they right? So these are the uh, police and and crime dogs uh, who are being awarded. This is uh, Dexter who's the Metropolitan Police's first well-being dog, and Oliver, who's thought to be the first justice facility dog. So, um, Dexter's work is directly with uh, police. Which one's Dexter? Uh, Dexter is here. Okay. I think this is Dexter here, who was originally a sniffer dog, called into action during um, COVID, and he helped out police officers. So, Dexter, um, they say, can have an instantaneous effect on officers and emergency responders who dealt with uh, harrowing incidents, mm. says uh, is uh, operator says that 15 minutes with Dexter can make a huge difference. Just uh, cheer someone up. And Oliver works in criminal justice, and they're saying, so, it, so for example, a 12-year-old uh, autistic girl who'd been raped, brought in to uh, answer questions with the police, um, wouldn't speak. They couldn't get the, mm. the child to speak. Um, Oliver comes in. And after a couple of minutes, just Oliver just comes in, lays his head on her lap, just relaxes, and then she starts just talking, just because it has that effect, that kind of calming effect. So two dogs are rewarded uh, for their services. Brilliant work.